Hi, welcome to Jonesy Tetsy Adventures. We're out down Braintree with me and I can looking for an historical artifacts. We're on Brian Day's field, my mate down Braintree. What do you think about this then, Ken? Expect so to get some hammered and gold coins and stuff. That's the hope, isn't it, Ken? Yeah, anything will be a plus. <laughs> Great, so we'll get off and get cracking and report later. Sixty nine. How's that pebble, man? Gee whiz. <laughs> like a big potato, but it's not. Right, carry on digging. Down here, then. Whatever that is. I'm sure that's a tin can. Next to the road, six to be expected, tin can. I've got a coin, I don't know if it's silver or what. I think it's silver. Okay, now what is it? Just find the button. And this is where I am, look. Just round here. Look at this. All barreled and dragged and whatever it's done here. Amazing. Beautiful land. I've got silver. That special kind of silver that you get. Called hammered. <laughs> well, we got up and hammered. Nothing like it. Look at that. Cracking. Half an hammered. We're, right, we're getting close to big hammered. This is definitely, definitely hammered. Jolly good. We've got there. That's probably half a groat, that. Half a long cross, probably. Let's check it out. Half a hammered. That's what we've got. Better than nothing. I also found a little buckle. 56. Oh, I think I got a coin there. I think I just seen it. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, maybe not. And we first button. First button of the day. Dandy button. 17, 18th century. Got a coin there. Georgia fifth. Penny. And the date of that is Georgia 6th Penny, 1936. That's on the top then. See the writing close up there, back seal, and that was really a very low figure on there on my machine 31. But there you go, a back seal lead. Ha <laughs> <laughs> pistol shot! Yeah, a bit of pottery. 
I'm not gonna give a, a dish I think mid 20 20th century I think We've got a, got a coin. Wow. <laughs> One coin for the use of naft. Mussel shells. Oh, mussel shells here. Aha, uh -huh, been eating mussels. Ah, right, just found a penny. I think it might be Queen Victoria, I'm not sure. Oh, it's got like a ring around it. Yeah. Just here. On this land here, that Brian Day's let us go on for the day. Massive, massive field. 76. Mm. Oh, we got it out. There it is. <laughs> We've got it in there. Oh, it's there. Ah oh dear, 1950s shirt button. Ah, two two cartridge. It's in there, 30 something. Oh, there it is. Some sort of uh, copper fastening. 66. Oh, she got some there. A button. Oh, a bit of blue glazed pottery. Bit of a flower there. Not quite sure what period that is, but probably early 20th century. Blue glaze. Oh, well, we've got a George III at uh, half 
bunny. 1806, probably around about that period. That's what we got there. Down there. That's a big nut, mate. I'm going nuts with a big nut. What's up? What's up? This, this is one hell of a field on this corner junction, but check this out. Look at the size of that. Massive. Absolutely massive is this. I can't down there somewhere. <laughs> Got a corner bit here. Corner bit, I'm just detecting on here. And look at the ground, it's just beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. All done and barreled and just how we want it, really. Perfect. And then, of course, look what comes out of this. Superbly done. Check this out. Oh, hammered. We got the hammer. I think it's uh, not quite sure yet. Details later. It's an old one. I think that's an old one. Look at that, boys and girls. I like a bit of that. That is very, very nice. We'll have a bit of that. And uh, if you turn it over, uh, short cross penny. Brilliant. Nice, 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 nice one. <laughs> bit of hammer. Can't beat it. Let's hope there's some more. Carry on with good work. Yeah. <laughs> Shells, Ken and mussel shells. Oh, yeah. yeah. Got our Ken here. He's called me over. He's got something. I don't know what it is. But he's called me over. He's got something, obviously, history. In the meantime, we have Bailey here. Hang on. Eighteenth century uh, pottery. Very nice. Probably uh, some sort of beer jug, I think. Yeah. Oh. oh, that's different, mate. Eh? Yeah, that's definitely old. Nice, that, isn't it? Very nice. That was uh, 22, and I've got this uh, dog collar to some person. We'll have to return this one. There you go, dog collar or dog tag. Very good. <laughs> so I've got the address on us, that. So that's what we have in the shape of a bone. And his name is Honey. The dog's name's Honey. Well, we'll have to give it him back. <laughs> Right, I've just got the signal and it's eyes only. Oh. 
Hmm. That's quite old, that, don't it? Interesting coloured stone. You know what that is? Interesting. Oh, there you go, door handle to 1870. This is a drawer handle. Brass. Brass bucket, but there you go, that's the age of that. Drawer handle. Oh, it's probably then a uh, musket shot. That's not right, it though. 55. Got it out, believe it or not. Down there, anyway. There it is. Well, it's a coin. Probably George the Third, half done it. Well, the detective day has ended. We've been searching for history around here do our best. It's been very interesting. What do you say, Ken? Yeah, we've done our best, you know, so we've had a good time. Uh, we've just did our best, really. Yeah, thanks for watching and catch you on another adventure.